Hello everyone, how are we all doing today? This is Ifi from Ifechi family. You are very, very welcome for those of you who are seeing me for the first time. And for my previous uh, subscribers, I thank you so much for keep coming back. Today, I want us to talk. Um, from the title, you already know what we are about, a law of attraction. The reason for this is that a lot has happened over the last few weeks uh, with my interaction with people and the, you know, the discussions and what uh, came out of it. I thought, you know what, we need to talk about this because what we attract in our lives is actually what happens. So what actually is a law of attraction? In simple terms, it's just a, it's a philosophy suggesting that positive thoughts brings positive results into our lives and negative thoughts brings negative results into our lives. That's exactly, you know, as simple as that. So instead of us focusing on, on things that we do not want to happen in our lives, let's spend some time and focus on things that we actually want to happen in our lives. You know, the th things we focus on are things that we actually attract. For example, starting a business, let me just use that as an example. We can say to ourselves, oh, I can't do it. I'm not kind of that kind of person. We give excuses why we cannot do it. But really, we haven't given ourselves that chance to do it. So that's negative thought. We have to think positively. And then we can attract what we actually want. Some people are always thinking of, you know, some people are in poverty today because they're always thinking of lack. Oh, I don't have that. I can't afford it. You know, I'm from a poor family. We can't afford that. So what we actually uh, say is what act, uh, happens in our lives. Some people want a perfect, well, it does anything like that, perfect marriage or perfect relationship or near to perfect marriage or perfect relationship. But there's no sign of them working towards that, uh, towards achieving it. They always look at other people, they think that their marriage or their relationship is fantastic and they want to be like them, but they're not actually working on their own relationship or marriage or friendship, or whatever it is. They're not working on it, but they just want to be like the other person all the time. No, it's not very good. You know, so we have to always make sure that we work towards what we want to happen or achieve in our lives. There are actually three laws of attraction, but I'll just talk about one of them today, which is like attracts like. We are more likely to hang out with people of similar background, be friends with them. We are more likely to want to marry or have relationship with people in a um, similar uh, socioeconomic background or similar level of vocabulary or education. I'm not saying that it's always the case, but we are more likely to lean towards that. And what it really means is that our thoughts attract what we, uh, what we want as our, our results. Sorry, our thoughts, yes, attract our results. This is simply because what we think about and believe in is what we tend to do. What we always think about and we believe in it, that's what we always tend to do. So limited and negative thinking actually leads to limited action or even counterproductive action and produces a very negative result. Because we are thinking, oh, I can't, no, I don't believe in this. So you have, you know, you have very, very limited um, thinking about positive things. And that's what you attract into your life. So it's very important that we attract things that are positive into our lives and always think positive. Don't just be dream, dreaming. Our action must harmonize with our dreams. 
Sometimes we dream that of this being in that place or having that kind of job or having that kind of uh, family or having that kind of husband. It's just a dream. If you don't really work towards it, have positive mindset. This is what I want and I'm going for it. And you work hard towards it and you attract it into your life. You'll be very, very happy that you do. You did. But when you are when you are around negative people, you just have to get yourself out of uh, uh, that kind of people because law of attraction means that if you are with those kind of people, they will attract you into their negativity. So you always want to be with positive people, attract positive things into your life, speak positive things into your life. And only God will direct you as well. Not man. Don't let any man think that, oh, without me, you can't be where you are. Or without me, you can't do this or do that. No. Let us always know that man can only, if we trust man, we can, we can get what man can give. But if we trust God and work hard as well. I've said it before in one of my videos that you can't just be saying, oh, it's not my portion, God will not allow this, this and that, and you're not actually doing anything to help yourself. Then, you're just, you're just wasting your time. So, like attracts like. What you like is what is going to come into your life. And I'm sure nobody wants anything that is bad or anything that is wrong uh, to come into their, uh, to their, uh, their lives. So, what we attract is what will come into our lives. Let's aspire and talk less of negative things. Talk less, less of I can't, or I won't be able to, or I, I don't know how to. Let's talk less about things like that because our, our, our thoughts are what we say actually carries a lot of weight. So, as I said before, law of attraction is a philosophy suggesting that positive thoughts brings positive results and negative thoughts brings negative results into our lives. There's this saying that the present is always perfect and you can also perfect the present. Yes, the present is always perfect and you can al also perfect the present so there's no nothing there's nothing that is damaged already even whatever it is your present can be a perfect and you can also perfect your present so let us not be discouraged by people let us always have the word i can and i am in our thoughts all the time even if people are saying to us or even our spouse or anybody wants to talk us down, you know, and say, oh, don't bother about that. No, we need to support each other and encourage each other and keep saying even to our children, to our spouses, to people, we, uh, our friends, people we relate with. When they share their vision with us, when they share what they actually want to do with us, let us be positive. Let us push them to positive, um, with, let us push them to a positive side. And not saying to them and not laugh and say, <laughs> you think you can do that? No. Let a law of attraction be what we need to focus on all the time. When we want to do anything, when we want to achieve anything, let's just have that positive thought. Let's drop the negative. I know that it's not always um, easy to drop the negatives because they will always come. It's like, oh, I failed the last time. What, 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 how do I, how do I know that I'm going to um, achieve it this time? No, just say to yourself, yes, I may have failed the last time, but this time around, I'm going to go for it. Be positive. Positivity is what we need going forward. So if you're one of those ones uh, that is always uh, negative, change your mindset today. Talk about, you know, positivity. Aim for it, dream and action, and put your dream in action. Not just dreaming and leaving it there. I hope we have got one or two things from this uh, short uh, 
discussion uh, or short um, talk today uh, on law of attraction, I'm sure we have benefited from one or two things. If you don't take anything away, remember that the present is always perfect and you can also perfect the present. Nothing is um, damaged, no matter the stage you are in your life, no matter your age. Don't look at your age and say, oh, my mates are there, my mates are there. No, there's nothing like present. Start from now. Now is your present and walk towards your goal and walk towards whatever you want to do. But always remember to be positive. Be positive. Be positive. Thank you so much for listening. And I'll see you again very, very soon. Please subscribe if you have not done so. And share this video. Thank you so much for listening. And I'll speak to you again soon. Goodbye and God bless you. Bye.